Alright, so we're checking out Joyner Lucas, got a new song called Snitch, in brackets Evolution. I've just seen the top comment and it's none other than the fucking king of reactions himself, No Life Shack. I'm here for the 6 9 comments, you know, little Snitch 9. Very, very topical. So, yeah, let's see what this song is saying. Am I boring you? We're gonna have a little movie thing as always. Joyner loves his like movie esque music videos, always high production. I'm Detective Haggerty. It's Detective Jones. I'm sure you already met him. <clears throat> My man. <laughs> Why do you say it like that, though? <laughs> My man. My man. Look at this lovely cast of characters. Let me tell you something right now. These guys are in the next room over. And you know what they're doing? They're fucking singing. Look at you. I see you sweating. Feels like the wall's closing in on you, don't it? You feel that pressure. Just drop a dime. We're right here. We can do this the easy way, or we can do it the hard way. They're lying. They're, 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 they're lying to him. They're trying to make him break by telling him his friends have snitched. Okay. The easy way, or we can do it the hard way. But I need some information, and I need it right fucking now. Snitch. 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 This your motherfucking conscious, nigga, don't even do it. Don't start acting like a bitch because you forgot where you're going. You made choices that didn't put you here and now you just... Just off the rip that just the, this is your conscious, don't act like... That is very, very Eminem-like and I've just pressed back. Okay, fucking brilliant. That was very Eminem-like. It reminded me of guilt, Guilty Conscious. So just, just the way you came in there, okay, okay. The fucking conscious nigga, don't even do it. Don't start acting like a bitch because you forgot where you're going. You made choices that done put you here and now you just ruined. And I don't care about why you did it or who got you influenced. Nah, don't listen to that nigga, that ain't good advice. If you cooperate, then it's your chance to save your life. Just tell them what they want to know and you won't pay the price. Some will call it snitching, but for me, I call it make it right. Man, fuck that make it right shit. You got to sit to your bed. You should have. Oh, this is, this is hard. I feel I feel like this is like a shot. I feel like it's a fucking shot at six nine. Just just the whole just the whole concept of it. Um, it's a tricky one to be fair. I mean, if you get into that, like if you're if you're doing this stuff, right? If you're if, if you're doing the crime, surely you should be about that life enough to not. But then at the same time, if snitching gets you out of the situation, I mean. Especially if you're literally going to be put away for pretty much your whole entire life and they'll be like, yeah, no, we'll put you in for a couple months if you just tell us. I guarantee you 90% of people, 90% of normal people would do that. I don't know about the actual proper people that are involved with this stuff, the, the gang life, because, you know, it's, it's, all, it's all a bit mad. You can get torn apart. The fuck that make it right shit, you gotta sit to your bed You should have thought about this shit before you did what you did Give a fuck about your family or your bitch or your kids You either gonna respect the code or you gonna get what you give Who gives a fuck about the codes, no one follow codes We both know that jail ain't the place you wanna go Somebody fucking on your bitch, you trying to call a phone If I was you, I'd tell them boys everything they wanna know Okay, let's think about this, let's embrace it Let's make an illustration. Let's say you switch up with it and bitch up in and make a statement. Now niggas in jail, that nigga ain't telling, had no stitch temptations. Now you might be free, but you might get killed for giving up information. And it That's the thing, exactly. Yeah, yeah, now you're out. But then all the other people that are out that are part of your gang as well, now they, they, they know you fucking snitched and then you're just, now you're just a target. Now you gotta move. You gotta change your fucking life. You gotta, you gotta fucking change up your whole lifestyle. You just, you, you literally gotta dash. Because you fucked it where you, where you're staying right now. You can't you can't go back to that place. Mad.
statement. Now niggas in jail, that nigga ain't telling, had no stitch temptations. Now you might be free, but you might get killed for giving up information. And if you don't get killed, then that's a rap. Everybody gonna know you as a rat. Won't get no respect for the rest of your life. Nobody won't know you after that. You might get run, but you never could hide. How long you hoping that'll last? For they catch you slipping and give you something that you know you had Fuck to have. Fuck that. Let's say you keep your mouth shut and take the blame for it. Now you need money on your... Yeah, this is very guilty conscious S, because he's obviously got like the good cop, bad cop situation going on. Like the angel and the devil on the shoulder. Dr. Dre and Eminem. Okay, I fucking like this. And the way he came in with it. We all know Joyner can rap fast, but that little double touch. Ooh, it's too clean. They won't know you after that. You might get run, but you never could hide. How long you hoping that'll last? For they catch you slipping and give you something that you know you had Fuck to have. Fuck that. Let's say you keep your mouth shut and take the blame for it. Now you need money on your books. Ain't no one paying for it. No visitations or no letters you've been waiting for. That pussy you've been craving for. You may not get laid no more. And all them niggas that you call your brothers will be ghosts. The only one who got you is your mother if you're close. A bunch of niggas screaming free you and making posts. No one show up to your trap. Now, niggas pray that you can smoke Man, please tell me you ain't about to take the sucker's advice Your kids will grow up knowing that you just a sucker for life Lacking morals and integrity will come with a price And if you fold it, you should know that we ain't nothing alike And if you leave in here tonight, you better cut <laughs> My man didn't even try to escape What the fuck was that? He was bracing for impact before And if you fold it, you should know that we ain't nothing He's like, oh like and if you leave in here tonight you better cop a burner don't fuck around and be somebody ain't nobody heard of now here's your choice be a man or be somebody murdered it's either you could take the stand or you be bobby smurder free bobby smurder oh free bobby smurder i swear it was meant to be out this year is it meant when wait wait okay no it was next year okay that's fair 2016 Fam, time is time just fucking flies. Holy shit. Alright, man. It's, it's me, Vic, and Rico, and C Dot. You know what I mean? The operation was really Vic's plan. You know what I mean? He was a top dog. You know, Rico. This guy's this guy's gonna get fucked up. If it, if, it, if it shows anything at the end here, how long is it? Go like 40 seconds. I feel like this guy's gonna get fucked up. And sort of ran with whatever Vic was doing, you know what I mean? I was involved in it, but I really wasn't, I really was just, you know, was told what to do. Like, I wasn't, you know what I mean? These guys was either do what, what they say or that was, that was me, you know? Did I told you none of his other people snitched him. I died. That was, that was me, you know? Snitch, 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 snitch. What's up now, nigga? Who saw that one coming then? What's up now, nigga? I want to see my lawyer. Hmm. And yeah, negotiate a better deal with a lawyer, to be fair. Don't just fucking tell him then and there. You will fuck yourself. Fair. That was. That was hard. That was that was that was very hard. I feel like that was just a, as I said, just a complete shot at six nine. Nobody's gonna forget about that. But I don't understand. I don't understand the love that six nine gets. Like I actually do not understand. Like he bangs views on YouTube and that. I don't know if he actually pops off as much on. I mean, thirteen million. It's not. It's, it's obviously not fucking bad. It's good, but compared to his YouTube stuff, like his YouTube stuff makes him seem like he's the biggest artist in the fucking world. But obviously, he's nowhere near that. Hopefully, he will never be anywhere near that. And I mean, he he rides his fucking tat like tattletales. He literally just rides it. He... Fair play to him. All right. <laughs> All right, that was Joiner Lucas Snitch. Leave a like if you enjoyed. Comment anything else I should react to. Uh, subscribe. You can check out my Instagram. It should be on screen. Uh, there's also a link in the description and I'll see you in a bit.